I have no family history, no diabetes. And I went for a regular checkup probably in my mid-20s and they found my creatine levels quite high. So um, that was my family doctor at that time. And uh, they seen there was a problem with my kidney. So they sent me to a nephrologist. And they said, eventually you're gonna have problems with your kidney. And uh, over the years, I was very careful. Not really, I was actually, my mid-20s, uh, I still, you know, party this and that, but I was still quite careful what I was eating and everything. And then, uh, and then uh, it lasted till my probably till my mid forties. That's where I start losing energy, and uh, basically it was time to go on dialysis. When it got serious, then uh, I started, you know, getting desperate. Basically, uh, I go, "Why me?" and I told my family members and then they went for tests and it wasn't a match. I, I even tried to, which was illegal, go overseas and buy and get a kidney, which uh, I did my research and uh, it wasn't really a good idea because there's a lot of cases where people go overseas, they don't even come back. So I said, I better stick with uh, the system over here and be patient. And uh, the nurses at the uh, Scarborough General, they're very uh, helpful. They educated me on uh, the different uh, types of dialysis, which I had no idea, basically, that uh, there were two different types of systems. And uh, then I just accepted it, and I chose the type of dialysis that was suitable uh, for my lifestyle. It became part of my life, basically. 